All right, so I'm here today to, uh, you know, basically make this video because, well, I watched the debate a few days ago, and uh, unfortunately, after the debate was over, um, when Keemstar put up a poll on Twitter, Every brain dead person sided with this bumbling idiot right here. You can see the name. His name is Technicals. And, uh, you know, I don't think Technicals really understands the difference between high schoolers dating high schoolers and the difference between. Adults dating minors. So, for that reason, I'm going to start this video now. Because we're at a point where they start getting juicy and heated. So, watch. Go ahead. Okay. So, um, three months ago, there was some interesting, interesting stuff. I'm um, post this in general. Uh, let me know if this was, if you got hacked or anything, because I have some follow-ups on that, Augie. Where you said, you only think two high schoolers dating is a crime because you're afraid of Twitter. Very few people in real life think, think about this. And then you clarify at the bottom, 18 to 15 is fine. That's literally my only point. In the context of a high school relationship, yes, 18 to 15 is fine. So an adult with a minor is fine, is what you're saying. He's not actually saying that an adult with a minor is fine. He's saying that a high schooler with a high schooler is is fine because if you check if you check the age difference of every high schooler, high schoolers can can go from four, fourteen to 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 17 or 18 the majority though is 18 because the age of a high school senior most likely is 18 not 19 so when Augie says that uh, that 15 to 18 year olds are fine it is because well in his in his state texas there's a thing called Rom romeo and juliet laws and uh clearly it is not wrong in my opinion for a minor to hang out with, a, with another minor at a prom at a high school. So, if you compare a 15 year old and an 18 year old as a high schooler, which they are, then uh, it is morally morally okay for them to go prawn together. That's what Augie meant. No. I'm That's talking about high schoolers. Saying. Well, I mean, legally, Just yes, an 18-year-old would be an adult, old. but I'm saying in, high, in a high school context, yeah. yeah, I agree with those. Weird. So if Nick you thought think a 19-year-old and a 14-year-old uh, is fine, do you think that that's fine? No, I condemned it. I think that's weird as shit that you would say oh, that. Oh, okay. Um, it, it, you could have fooled yeah. me from your video, but okay. You could have fooled me from that tweet on all your stances. But well, no, okay. actually, I couldn't. It's very clear what I'm saying. Yeah, that you think an adult being with a minor is fine. That's... Again, I just explained it. That's not what RC is saying at all. The difference between... 
an adult dating a high schooler is that if you're an adult and if you are not grad and if you are like graduated from high school and you are no longer in high school anymore then it would count as e something that is illegal to be doing to a minor but if you're in high school already and not even graduated yet because you're a senior at high school at the age of 18 uh, hanging out with a minor then it is not morally wrong to 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 be with a minor That's the most retarded interpretation that tweet well, I think I mean, I've ever fucking heard. <laughs> an 18 year old is an adult. Yes, technically. And I hate this argument when people used all for all these years, saying that the, eight, that the age of 18 technically means that you're an adult. No, it does not. When I found out why people keep saying this and why there was a law back in the earlier days before we were all born which would probably be in the 1900s or in the 1800s as to why they let you become an adult at the age of 18 is because they think that 18 is at least the responsible age of an adult when clearly no one has figured out the fact that uh, um oh I don't know maybe that uh, when maybe that uh, scientifically of course the age of the age of 18 is technically not the age of an adult because scientifically you are still a minor therefore you're still a teenager the age of 19 same thing scientifically you're still a minor therefore you're still a teenager 20 is where it makes sense. At the age of 20, you are te technically an adult. That's how I picture it. Because if you really count the age numbers, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Those are all original ages of being a teenager, not an adult. Got it? year old is an adult and in this specific context a three-year age gap is totally fucking fine in a high okay. school relationship there's nothing surprising about that statement well, how about me. how about a five-year age gap let's go to my, my next one that's terrible uh, here's yeah here oh it's terrible okay that's weird here's this tweet right here uh if you go to the likes this guy's talking about the only reason why i'm replying is because i see another stupid witch hunt in the works the kid is 19 years old and the other is 14 I mean, it's gross, sure, but people acting like he's a pedo are fucking stupid. The one like on this is, is from Red Fox Comms. You didn't say it, you just liked it. It Wait, was in what? October 2020. Can you link me this? So I, can I just linked it in general. Yeah, go ahead, have a look. Make sure you didn't Suss get hacked man? there. Yeah. So I liked the tweet in 2020, and that's indicative of my values? You don't think I just fucking... No, what do you think about it? didn't think too shit about it? I disagree. Wait. What do you think about that tweet? 19-year-old and a 14-year-old? No, that's absolutely wrong. 
and pedophilic. Yes, a 19-year-old doing this to someone who is likely... Thirteen, fourteen years old, or even as younger as, like,、uh, let's say, ten years old. Yes, that is morally wrong. But a senior age, the age of eighteen, hanging out with a minor at a high school—that's not wrong at all. Why did you like a tweet saying it's not pedophilic? I have no fucking idea. Probably like a thousand. I probably、okay, like thirty thousand fucking but, tweets. Are、uh, uh, you on Benadryl or something? Are、uh, you on Benadryl? So that's a weak point. That's a weak point. That's I'm not actually laughing that that's the evidence that you were hyping up on Twitter. Time out. Time out. Time out. Let me ask you a question. Biggest reason I've ever heard. So yeah, go ahead. We're saying we're saying nineteen fourteen bad, eighteen fifteen bad. Absolutely. Good. Yeah. Eighteen fifteen good. Yes, because again, that is the age of high schoolers. I don't know if it's good, but I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Like in a high school relationship, let's clarify that I'm talking specifically about high schoolers, right? So a senior dating a freshman is something that, on its own face value, I don't necessarily have an issue. I think that's right. That's, fuck. that's creepy.、Okay. That's yeah, it's、crazy. kind of strange. You hold that opinion, but you're so how is that exonerating zero? Who's、because、exonerating him? I said he was guilty of that because I thought、charitable. it was weird. Well, you, it was, oh, like you and Zappa? He was so guilty of that that like you and Zappa come back and make videos. Zappa didn't even come close to yeah, what you're talking about. Yeah, you should be allowed、about. to make videos. Okay. I don't think didn't even come that、close. even you previously、really? admit are dangerous or, or were a previous harm to children or who are guilty of committing a pedophilic action should be making videos. Can you admit right now that Zappa was a harm to children? No, he wasn't. He wasn't. No. So twenty and sixteen is good in your eyes. Technicals is so stupid for bringing up satire for no reason that I have no obligation to actually hear this bullshit or to actually put this in this video. So I will probably probably edit that out because it's not. Okay, for somebody like that, technicals here to slander somebody who was just got cleaned out of wrongdoing. No, so he was a danger to children. No. <laughs> <laughs> But come on, Augie. Come on, Augie. You can I mean, you can simultaneously you can be no, no no you can be guilty of doing something wrong, but also not be a danger to children. Wow, it's amazing how charitable you are for him, huh? This seems really weird. But that's really like, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, that's like saying you know somebody went out there and you know shot somebody with a gun, but they're not a danger to have a firearm anymore. Like what? Like no, they have a history of doing that. Like Santai has a history. Of you know talking to the sixty. The difference between between doing pedo shit and doing the、uh, guns is that one, it's illegal to buy guns for reasons without having your own gun license. Second. Going out with a high schooler because you are a high schooler yourself at the age of eighteen is not illegal. You're in high school, you're out of prom, and you're just dancing or hanging out with each other. That is not illegal. Sixteen-year-old engaging sexually with her online, you know, you would come to the conclusion that he is a danger to children. Just the same way. Well, you would be guilty of mishandling a gun, but not be a danger、uh, when holding a firearm. What? I would so compare. I would、so、compare with Zapti. So Zapti, what Zapti? Zapti didn't. Was an accident? Was it intentional? I didn't say it was an accident. I said it was inappropriate. Okay. But I'm saying you're comparing two completely 
different things. You can't, you like, know that, in order for me to concede to the set point, wrong. I would have to have the most two-dimensional binary fucking thinking in the, on the You're point. actually, not how it works. Every time Zaptai's talked about this, he said it was wrong, but you're actually saying that 1620 is good, so that's, that's I interesting. Literally, so to technicals, notice the chat, how tech just lied here. I literally how said I lie? it was wrong. And technicals, you now are the argument is fine. Notice how you also said it was fine. If it was a high school setting, 18 and 15, that's why I was yeah, 18 and 15, but 20 and 16 is no longer a high school setting. You're fucking okay. loving. Okay. That's right, not so technical. I'm being very... And see, Augie is right. He is. But uh, here's the disappointing part. Consistent here. Look, okay, so technicals I guess... just lied. Okay, so Zaptai was in the wrong. All right, that's 100%. Yeah. Tacticals is zero in the wrong. Is zero guilty? Is... Yeah, zero was in the wrong. Yeah, I agree. Okay, so so in both of these cases, Zaptai and Zero are guilty, and both of you guys went out of your way to defend them on different allegations where they are innocent of. So what is the beef about? Well, in one case, he thinks that it's it's somehow different. Like he thinks that oh, the shit was Zaptai. It's not actually that bad. He wasn't a threat to kids. But then he rationalizes that my situation is any different, which makes no fucking sense, while also being cool with 18 to 15, which I think is really weird, personally. Um, I don't really think you think that's really weird, I think you're just I virtue do. signaling. So. I do. Yeah, I'm virtue signaling. I'm because virtue I don't signaling. think how you- I don't know how you could have such a strong issue with 18 to 15, but then be so charitable to zero. Like, that just I doesn't never make said, sense to me. I never said, fuck yeah, dude, this is sick. This was sick that you did this. You never said that, but your yeah, video no. obviously paints a narrative that Zero's worthy of forgiveness. Would you agree with that? Yeah, I think people are redeemable. Okay. You obviously agree since you're friends with Zaptai. Well, I think there's a I think there's a line that's crossed. Let's not act like Oh yeah, the line is who, who agrees with you? Who's your idol? No, the line is uh friend. the line is requesting child porn. That's the line I would say. Oh, so okay. having okay. images. Okay, time out, time out, line. Yeah, I 100% agree, and I'm empathetic. That's why I brought up the situation. It's not exactly. that I'm bringing up random shit because, oh, the whole, I just wanted to go after his family because I said, fuck him, dude, like that. No, not at all. I'm drawing a parallel to the situation Tactical. and coming to my own conclusion so, on why I think might Tacticals. be emotionally invested in this situation. I'm let me, let me grab the mic, let me grab the mic real quick. Tacticals, this question is to you. Um, okay. do you really feel that it's an all-out witch hunt against you and that they're using your brother as a pawn or, you know, is it related? Do they have a point that these two situations are related? I don't think that their side at all can establish that there's some kind of sexual motivation for anything that they're bringing up with my brother. And the fact that I did condemn it anyways would mean that I'm consistent on the zero topic, so it's wholly irrelevant. Interesting. Well, I, I don't know. I'm kind of up in the air on, on the whole brother issue. I can see why Augie and Nick are bringing it up, right? Because yeah, I but see like, how it relates. But I also see what you're saying. Like, look, I've condemned this. This is wrong, right? You know, I condemn yeah. zero. That's wrong. Uh, so I, I, you know, I'm somewhere in There's the no there. excuses for it. There's nothing that should be brought up. You're so hyper-focused on excuses. If you want to play, because that's you're what so the fucking video was about, man. If you want to play that the video, if you want to talk about, here's what Zero did right, and here's what Zero did wrong, and then here's the fucking end of your later. All right, that's all fine and dandy. But you know, why are you getting emotional, dude? Shut the fuck up, dude. <laughs> what a real conversation sounds like. Maybe if you had more fucking yeah, this emotion, is a real you'd be better at selling your fucking arguments, dude. No, maybe if you stop smirking for like two seconds, we could have a Maybe if you stop ad homing every time I spoke and actually listen to my points. Oh, yeah. You complain about that a lot, yeah. but you do the oh, same yeah. shit. You're mad weird. You're weirder. <laughs> Alright, let's you take a think break. What do I think? Break? For 10 year old girl to show my oh, you. Should be allowed to make videos for kids. <laughs> I think high schoolers should be allowed to date. We are not comparable at all. Alright, alright. Because you think 18 to 15 is good, which I think a majority of people, a large I majority. I never said it was good, you're lying again. You just you're lied saying it's fine. Bit. You just lied. Chat, it's notice good, how you lied again. Good, not Roll a the tape back. Good, not the fucking tape back. Roll good, the tape not back. Good, not a lied. I lied. So you're yes. walking back that 18 to 15. I never said it was good. I said it's fine. So what that, that's literally a synonym. Shut the fuck up. So you're saying that that's good. Oh, okay, uh, dude. Good one. Which a majority of people would good love one. to be weird for that and would disagree with you. 
but I'm not gonna go and start calling you a pedophile. You're acting like I'm promoting it. Like, I'm like, 18 and 15 year olds should all fuck up or something like that. They should all fuck up. I think 18 year old and 15 year old should fuck. That's not what I'm saying at all, you fucking moron. Are you retarded? Are you are you brain dead? Well, tacticals, tacticals. Loggy's point with the 15 to 18 year old is, look, if you're both in high school, you should be able to date. That's his point. And that's exactly what I've been saying. So it is fine for to date a 15 year old or 14 year old in high school at a prom. That's what it is. dating a 15 year old which are both high school ages so technically he did say high schoolers can date high schoolers it's just in a different kind of context I literally specify I'm talking in a high school context. But you're going to the extreme oldest high schooler, which is legally an adult, to the youngest high schooler. Not legally an adult, unless they're graduated. An 18-year-old is not officially graduated until, like, June or May. That's when, uh... That's when it's no longer acceptable for an 18-year-old to date a minor. Which is 15, which is creepy. Like, uh, Again, an older high schooler dating a younger high schooler is not creepy. That yeah. is creepy. That's totally fine. I'm totally fine with people thinking that creepy. To be honest, I don't know if I consider that creepy. I just don't have an issue with it. I don't think okay, it's federal. Well, I, I think it's creepy. And I grew, I've up, in a, I grew up in an area where three-year age gaps were common. Maybe you grew up in an area where that wasn't. I don't know. I don't oh, know. So you're tell saying you. your childhood? Uh, kind of I agree with Foggy because, again, I explained this earlier. There are Romeo and Juliet laws in his state of Texas. So, therefore. It wouldn't be morally wrong for a high schooler to date another high schooler who's likely to be in ninth grade or 10th grade. It would not be wrong at all. That's what Augie is saying here in the first place. And that's why he mentioned that a 15-year-old can date an 18 year old in high school because it's fine and if you read the Romeo and Juliet laws then you know that I kind of contributed to that is that what you're saying Augie Oh, that's right. So if Zero's from Japan, I guess you could fuck 10-year-olds. No, 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 no. I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering where you got. I'm curious where you know, actually, actually, let's go down this road. I'm curious where you're changing this subject. Why are you changing this subject? Wait, 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 Okay, where is this girl from? Uh, I'm not sure because she's anonymous, but I'm pretty sure it's somewhere in America. Okay, so is he originally from Japan? No. Oh, he's not from Japan. If you read this, in the United States, many states have adopted close-in age exceptions. These laws, known as Romeo and Juliet laws, provide that a person can legally 
have consensual sex with a minor provided that he or she is not more than a given number of years old, generally four years or less. And if you read from this website here, according to Texas, Texas is Romeo and Juliet law. Anyone between the ages of 14 and 17 can legally give consent to have sex with someone within three years of their age. This means that an 18 year old and 15 year old would be able to have consensual sex under Texas law without it being considered a child sex offense. Therefore, I just showed you a while ago, then he would have been in the right, but all those people who are probably technical fans, they're probably too brain dead to understand that, and they're just trying to use this advantage against Augie RFC. So, yeah. At the end of the day, Augustus clearly is the victorious winner of, of this stupid debate against technicals, which I guess this is him right here since I got that from his Twitter account. But yeah, technicals technically kind of lost. And Augie kind of won because I understand these laws perfect perfectly. I've heard about them way, way long before this discussion here even existed last week. So about it really so and if you're that type of person who supports technicals here I gotta ask you a question what the hell are you doing like what the hell are you doing what the hell are you doing not reading into the laws very well what the hell are you doing Anyway, that's 
That's what I'm saying. Fucking <sighs> Christ, this was completely a stolen election from what you ever see. Like, he should really demand a recount of these votes. These votes are, are a scam. Really. They are, just, they are such a scam. Now, I never want to see them again.